I am very concerned that this, if this issue isn't taken care of, how are we, how are we going to feed people? Right? I mean, the prices can only get so high, people aren't going to purchase anymore. And I will say this, if they get so high, Americans will find a way, which will be really interesting to see how innovative they become. 今天我邀请了一位美国朋友劳拉，我们一起去逛一逛 Costco， 看看通胀对他的家庭采购预算构成了怎样的影响。Usually, like our grocery bill was half of what it was two years ago. Now it's twice as much for the same things, and I'm not even buying as much. I'm buying less than I've ever had. My husband said, "Buy all the avocados you can. Freeze them." <laughs> This bag has six, six avocados inside. And this is almost nine dollars. I would say with the tax. That's actually not bad. It doesn't look bad when you look at it now, and if you're just buying one bag and leaving. But when you add ten dollars to all the other things you're buying, it is expensive. Terrible. I, that's actually the most expensive I've seen. Wow. It should be a couple dollars. It's always been that way my whole life. It has always been that way. I am just so shocked. I think I spent the highest I've spent is twenty-seven dollars for just celery, and I think I got like eight stalks. Since I started drinking celery juice, two dollars always. We've cut out yogurt. You cut out yogurt? Yeah, because it got really, really high at one point. I think it's leveled off a little bit. I just spent ten dollars for a quart of regular, just regular whole fat yogurt, nine ninety-nine. I was like shocked. I used to spend. I found an old receipt. I was looking for receipts for you. I found one for one sixty-five. It's usually between one sixty-five and one eighty-five. I try not to go to over two hundred a week because then I'm throwing food out. It's only the three of us. And now I went to the grocery store for to get Valentine's dinner for the family, and it was two hundred and twenty-two dollars. And I got ground beef. I didn't get any and vegetables and fruits. I would say definitely beef. I've never seen such high beef prices. There are communities, especially in New Jersey, who have come together and they've decided to eliminate any box stores from their budget. So what they do is, is we have a lot of farms in New Jersey. They're getting their beef from the farm. So how we get things is now completely different than two years ago, and I'm actually okay with that. Even if it costs me more, I'm happier. Supporting a local farmer than just going to Whole Foods or Acme or Costco. I think it's impacted me in a positive way because it's really forcing me to make sure that I'm spending and budgeting properly, that I'm being very careful and very methodical about what I'm buying. I think that my big concern is is that. The inflation is going to get so high that there's going to be starvation, and 54 million people, you know, starved during the first year of COVID. 28 million were children. I <laughs>